the story. Characters portrayed and incidents in this production are fictitious. No identification with actual persons and products is intended, nor should be inferred. No person or entity associated with this film received payment or anything of value or entered into any agreement. This production has not been approved, endorsed, or authorized by Valerie Kaur or Van Jones. George Floyd's and Breonna Taylor's. Great question, Asa. The world needs caring and compassionate leaders because they affect absolutely everything. So let's all gather together and see what they have to say. When we are practicing revolutionary love, there is no way to be a bystander. And revolutionary love is an orientation to life that is personal and political. It is a, a way of moving through the world. It's a way of inviting people to see no stranger, even yourself, even your own body in a world that wants to make you strange to yourself, to love in all directions. If everyone could do things this way, the world would be very different. There would be so much less hate. Can we go to the playground? I'm so, so, so bored. Yeah, let's go. Okay, okay. For homework, I want you to review that Shabbat and think about the powerful messages you heard today. Class is dismissed. <laughs> I wonder if he does play football with them. Let's ask. Hey, can we 
you play too? Yeah, sure. <laughs> How did you miss that throw? You catch like such a girl, and you look like one too. What's that bow in your head? Stop! Let's start with that instead. Stop! Stop! Wait, the Stop. other girl has a bigger ball on her head. Let's get that one instead. Cut it out. Please. Don't come near me and let go of a girl. This is my butka. Since where to keep their long hair neat and clean? Patty cake, patty cake. Even more like a girl with just long hair. In America, we wear our hair shirt for long or short. We don't wear scarves. <laughs> What's going on? See this fist? In about five seconds, it's gonna be in your bloody face. <laughs> I'm not afraid of you boys. Leave my brothers alone. Asa, Asa, I got it. I got it. You're Christian, right? Duh, don't you know who Jesus Christ is? Yeah, I do. And I also know he had long hair. Is he a girl? No, but that was like 2,000 years ago. What's your point? Do you have a dollar bill? Yeah, why? Take it out and I'll tell you why. Whose face is on that dollar bill? Everybody knows that. George Washington, you dummy. Does he have short hair? Whatever, I don't care about any of that. You boys still look like girls. Yeah, but Americans come in different shapes, sizes, colors of hair, skin, cultures, and faith. We're all Americans. That's what makes our country great. Let's not waste our time here with these obvious jerks. Let's get out of here. See you later, ladies. <laughs> so tough are we are you okay no i'm bleeding i think i broke my arm can you call my mom sure what's your name and her number my mom's number is 415-555-0916 and my name is daniel Hi, yes, this is our Zoe. I'm with Daniel and he fell off his bike. We think he broke his arm. Could you Thank come you. quick? You're welcome. Yes. We're at 167 Cedar Way. Okay. Your mom should be here really soon. Thank you. You're gonna be okay. Thank you. Honey. Thank you so much. You are such helpful girls. Mom, they're not girls. Wait, what? Sorry about the other day, guys. Mom, they're boys. They're part of the Sikh religion. Well, thank you so much, boys. It was so kind of you to help. Are you a friend of Daniel's? Yes, Daniel's our friend. How can we ever thank you? We don't need a thank you, ma'am. Daniel would have done the same thing for us. badly the other day? Wow, that's amazing. I didn't see a bad hit. 
I just saw a kid who needed help. We called his mom. Oh God, to God. I am so proud of you boys. Yeah, you guys were so nice to him and you handled the problem with love and not hate. It's not easy to love those that hurt us. What if everyone used love instead of hate to understand one another? Wouldn't George Floyd and so many others still be alive today? Yeah, but how does our whole country do that when it's filled with so much hate? Even our leaders solve problems with hate. I know, Asa, but change, it happens one person at a time, and we have to start with ourselves. Do you remember that Shabbat and Kalsa school you were studying? Nakoberi nehi begana Salamusan hamgobanai Is that Shabbat starting to make sense now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, I have no enemy, and I see no stranger. So that's why Valerie Kaur titled her book, See No Stranger. Wait, if love can overtake hate, then why aren't people like Valerie Kaur and Ben Jones running this country? They've solved so many more problems. I would vote for them. Yeah. <laughs> they certainly would do a better job than our current leadership. Agreed. Compassion. We know that it works. You kids saw it today when Daniel fell off his bike, right? Valerie and Van seem like really caring, compassionate leaders who just want to do the right thing. Our country would be so much better off if we could just choose the right leaders. Yeah! yeah. We are part of a movement equipping people to practice love as a public ethic. That's how we're going to turn the tide together. It's time to reclaim love. I believe that we can make love a public ethic in America over the next 25 years by the time our nation becomes a multiracial nation. I believe this is necessary, not just because it's possible, but because it will save our democracy. We are trying to make it possible for this country to come back together. We believe it's time to reclaim love as a force for justice in America.